Welcome back to the LEC as Australis took down Vitality with style and for the very first time in the LEC history, we have a pentakill on the crocodile. Void Knight, thank you so much for joining me today. I guess it's no surprise if I tell you that you won the player of the game with more than 85% of the votes. So let's talk about this pentakill and the performance you had on Renekton today. Uh, thank you, uh, Laura. Yeah, I mean, uh, <laughs> I don't know, like, I guess... Uh, I guess I just had a good game, you know, everyone has these sometimes, so, uh, yeah, I mean, I'm, of course, like, I was really happy about it, and uh, it was the first pentacle I think I ever got in competitive games, so it's nice to, like, end the uh, end the uh, split, at least with a good game. Yeah, I was about to say that's a good way to end the split for you guys, and you had an amazing performance, as I said, but um, it must have been weird for you to go into this Super Week knowing that playoffs were no longer an option, so tell me about the mindset and preparation going into these three games. Yeah, I mean, of course, it's a bit sad that we cannot go to playoffs anymore. But I guess our mindset uh, mostly coming into this week was just to have practice for summer split. And so we're taking all these games extremely serious. We're playing them as we, if we just to win every game, just as a practice for summer split, basically. That is a great mindset to have. And um, I want to believe that usually in difficult situations is the time where you learn the most uh, and you take the most of learnings. Uh, first off, do you agree with this statement? And is there anything you'll be able to take from this spring experience to translate it to a better performance in summer? Uh, yeah, for sure. Uh, tough times are always the ones times where you learn the most. And we, of course, here at Astralis have had some tough times. So, yeah, I mean, yeah, I just we will just bring this into summer split and hopefully hopefully be a playoff contender in the summer. So yeah, we'll see. Yeah. We, we saw some great things from you uh, actually during the past few weeks. So obviously, I, I, I think you'll be able to translate that in summer, but I'm looking at the last two games. You have SK and MAD. Is there anything you want to try or, uh, I don't know, do on stage during these last two games? Not to spoil anything, of course, but do you have any goals for the la these last games? <laughs> um, uh, personally, I don't really have uh, any goals. I mean, of course, I'm gonna like just focus on my own game, and um, we'll we'll try our hardest to win. And uh, but yeah, like I think I've, I'm pretty happy with my gameplay the last few weeks in general. And mm -hmm. yeah, I mean, it's just I, I can always improve. You know, I'm still still learning a lot every day in practice. So yeah. You have the right mindset, and I really hope that you'll be able to have a performance that makes you proud to wrap up this spring season. But White Knight, again, congrats on the Pentacle today, and congrats on the victory against Vitality. Thank you so much, Laura. You're welcome, and we're going to take a short break, and we'll come back in a few minutes with Fnatic versus Schalke Wolfier. Stay tuned.